Okay, we're going to go through the Gentle Person's Guide to Good Behavior, uh, one step at a time. The first rule, as it were, these are not cast in stone, you won't get arrested for not doing them, but if you want to be a nice person, you've got to consider these rules. And rule number one is really grant the person grace and being. Everyone's entitled to be here, and it's no good being funny about people that you don't approve of. They're only doing what you do, which is the best that you can think of. You do the best you know. Listen, even Hitler, dumb as he was and destructive as he was, wasn't doing anything different to what you and I do, which is what he thinks is the best, what's going to get the best outcomes for him or for the country or whatever his demented madness was about. Now, when I talk about this uh, clause or this rule, the overriding rule in the Gentle Person's Guide to Good Behavior. I like to quote something from the movies, and it's not often I do that, but if you remember the movie Avatar, and that lovely people called the Na'vi, who uh, lived in a forest tree and were clearly very spiritual and kind and gentle, they had a greeting which was, I see you. Uh, I'll put your hand on your heart and say, I see you. This is a supernoetic salute, if you like. I see you. And it's a really great way of saying to a person, you're important, you're valuable. I treasure having you in my environment. Listen, after I wrote this, a friend told me that apparently this is a Zulu salute. I didn't realize that. You know, the Zulu, the beautiful, tall, healthy tribesmen of Southern Africa. Uh, most of their traditions have gone, of course, under the onslaught of the Western world. But historically, apparently, one Zulu would meet another in the forest or on the plains and say, I see you, and the other one would say, I see you. And if they got really excited, they would say, I still see you. And the second one would say, yes, I still see you too. Now to that, actually, we might add also another phrase, I hear you, you know, I hear you, meaning I'm listening. And that leads us on to clause two, which is about listening. So let's move on. Okay, thank you for this one.